Hey guys, welcome back to this another tutorial for how to create RSS feed. In the last part we created this file, news file, and um, H, uh, XML file, which is right there. And it was called news one because I already had news for my website. So the coding, let's just say that I want to include, I create a new file in my PHP. Designer 7 and uh, I name it blah 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 maybe to your home page or whatever create a new HTML file and let's just give it a title RSS testing home page one home page and then body tag just write random stuff like uh, how are you today Please, RSS or RSS subscribers, whatever. And to add, um, let's just name this homepage by saving this in my tutorials folder. Let's just name it sample. You can name it whatever you want to index for the main homepage. And let's, if you want to put the icon right there, you go to your you go somewhere between your head tags, type a link, rel, alternative, or alternate, type, it's x, xml, text, slash xml, I can't really put the code, there's application, it's not text, App application RSS plus XML and then title of the page whatever and then reference tag which in this case is going to be news one dot h xml let's save this check it out oh, localhost tutorials let's go to our sample file okay sample dot htm says please RSS us and there you see RSS button right there I click it it's gonna take me to my RSS page and let's just say I want to put a link right there on the subscribe part so all I'm gonna do is put an anchor tag right there and right there please forgive me for my any spelling mistakes here because I'm not good Language arts person, then you're going to enter effort to um, use one.xml. That's all you need. Save it. Reload the page, and if you if they click this, they're going to take them to your file. So that was all tutorial. Please, please, please subscribe, rate, and comment on this video and look out for my other videos and last week I just made a video about comment system how to make a PHP comment system using MySQL so check that out and have a nice day thank you